Hi, it's Saturday, November 2nd, and today I'm doing my E4K walk 20 miles. I've changed my route a little bit after driving it. I realized exactly how much time I was going to be spending on a, well, basically a highway. Although the kind of highway you can walk on, because you know it's Massachusetts. But I was going to be spending a lot of time on a very busy road without a sidewalk. So I remapped my route last night, and I'm touring the Hamptons. Southampton, East Hampton, Northampton, and back, still for 20 miles. Now with much more bike trail. It begins here in this uh, nondescript location, a tractor supply parking lot. So I'm going to be here, I'm going to walk all the way up here, and then up through here, and then I'm going to come all the way back. I would do this, but this is all closed. And now I'm here. Still all this left to go. Apparently my E4K walks are all blessed by woolly bears. So the thing about New England in the fall and really almost any time of year, is that when you go off and pee in the woods, you come back with ticks on your pants. I pulled three off of my pants. At least, I hope that they're only on my pants. You think there is a trail, or they just want there to be a trail? So this is the end of the first leg of my journey, which is not quite halfway yet. I've still got a couple more miles to make it halfway. But this is the point where I'm going to stop and have some lunch and probably pick up some duct tape for a blister I have or that might be forming. And I am here. This gives me hope right here. Yes, person at Smith College, you are beautiful. Okay, so this is really cool. It's a please seat yourself chair, and I think I will. Look how far I am. Um, my turnaround point is really close, right around here somewhere. Should be just up ahead. Okay, so I've turned around a little before the actual turnaround point, because um, my left foot's bothering me. I got a blister and I put a blister thing on it, and so that worked for like the last few miles, but now it's getting kind of sore. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna do the whole 20 miles, then I'm going to turn around here, start heading back, and then if I need a ride, I'll call for a ride. One step at a time. All right, so I'm wrapping up. It's, uh, I don't know, it's like 4.30 or something. It's been a lovely day. My feet hurt. Chris is going to pick me up in the next street. I think I've done like 16 miles or something, which is pretty darn good for one day. And I think I'm ready to call it a day.